We're going to try to get a word here with Bulldog Bob Brown. Just caught a load of something that Hustler Rip Rogers got passed to him by Brenda Britt. Oh. Uh. I tell you, let's give uh, let's give him a second to try to get his eyes clear, get his wits about him. Uh, we got a VTR right now, King Kong, Bruiser Brody. Let's take a look at Bruiser Brody. We're back on All-Star Wrestling. Bob Brown's had a couple minutes to get his uh, eyes kind of clear, trying to get a little something going. I've seen a lot of things, and I never thought I'd say uh, anything complimentary to you ever again, but that was a low compl it was a low dig from uh, Hustler Rip Rogers. Maybe it's well, time to get a little I'll, even. I'll but. tell you what, there's no sense crying over spilled milk. You know, I didn't get the best of it, but I thought I did my job, and I thought I did it well. Yeah, and if I, I tell you what, if I ever, if I could have just grabbed her for another 30 seconds, I'd let everybody in the Midwest just knows what her body looks like, because I was on the verge of ripping her clothes off. Let me remind you one thing. Red Frog just think that he's got me, and he hasn't got, got me. Oh! He's got some kind of protective glove on his hand to keep that thing away from him. Uh, Bulldog Bob Brown is down. He's got that green slime. You bet with the Hustle Rip Rogers. Look at Bulldog Bob Brown now. Look at the so-called living legend of Bob Brown. Look at Bob Brown. Legend no more. New legend Hustle Rip Rogers. You're in no shape, Brown. You'll be in no shape, baby. And I'm the man around here. Yeah, that's it. Take care of daddy. Take care of daddy because I'm bad. I'll knock out anybody who gets in my way. Bruiser Brody included. Uh, David Brown's in the ring now. Bob Brown's son to try to render some assistance with dad. We gotta get somebody out here. We're gonna be back. You stay with us. More All-Star Wrestling right after this. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is one fall with a 60-minute time limit for the Central States Heavyweight Wrestling Championship. The challenger now making his way to ringside at 300 pounds, Santa Fe, New Mexico, Bruiser Brody. The defending champion weighs in at 252 pounds, Winnipeg, Canada, the Central States Heavyweight Champion, Bulldog Bob Brown. Managed at ringside by the doctor of style, Slick. Well, this is a match everybody in the building has been waiting for. King Kong Bruiser Brody against Bulldog Bob Brown. And here we go. And of course, Slick, I don't think he wants any part of Bruiser Brody. And to be quite honest, when the man weighs 300 pounds, I don't blame him. 
But the problem for Brody in this match, you've always got to be aware that Slick is somewhere at ringside. And look at Bulldog, he's running. He's got the track shoes on. Oh, look at him, now he's, he eye tailed it out of the ring. He wants to think about it for a minute. Now both men back up in the ring. I and see these, people going absolutely bananas. These two haven't even touched each other yet. Now they go at it. Bruiser Brody, deep down in his heart, has a hatred for Bulldog Bob Brown that I don't think any one match could ever settle. You are exactly right. I think Bulldog Bob Brown represents to Brody everything that is bad about professional wrestling. I'll give you a little clue. He, uh, he represents uh, everything that's bad in pro wrestling to a lot of people. By the way, if you've got a nonprofit club or a civic organization you'd like to sponsor All Star Wrestling to raise some money for your club, you can write us at All Star Wrestling, 910 Penn Suite 305, Kansas City, Missouri 64105. Listen to those people chant, Devin. They know who their favorite is, and his name is Bruiser Brody. And Brody's been chopping at Bulldog Bob Brown. Good arm day, back leg chip from Bruiser Brody in an arm bar. A lot of people don't realize, in addition to his expertise in just plain old beating people up, Bruiser Brody is an excellent wrestler. He can uh, drop kick, head scissor, he can do anything he wants inside that ring. Well, let's face it, the fans don't pay to see this man wrestle, they pay to see him beat people up. Because that's what Bruiser Brody likes to do, man. He likes he to loves beat it. people up. And anytime you see Bulldog Bob Brown against Bruiser Brody, you know it's going to be a war. You can see it right now. The Central States Heavyweight Championship is on the line. We're going to stay with this match just as long as we can. Brown trying to chop his way out of an arm bar. Oh! Brody's having none of it. Brody says if you want to play that way, yeah, we'll play that way. Bruiser Brody against Bulldog Bob Brown. Brown. Probably one of the out and out most evil men in professional wrestling. And with the addition of this dapper gentleman at ringside, we speak, of course, of Slick, it adds a new dimension to the already obnoxious reputation of the Central States Heavyweight Wrestling Champion. And again, we're going to stay with this match as long as we possibly can to see if we get a decision here. It is Brody against Brown for the Central States title. Slick pacing up and down at ringside. The fans are chanting Brody, Brody, and Bulldog Bob Brown now starting to go on the offensive against Bruiser Brody. Well, that's going to do it for us. Till next week, for Rick Stewart, I'm Kevin Wall. Thanks for joining us. So long, everybody.